Hey everyone, Zapcart is back with another initiative, hiring opportunity to hire the students for specifically SD roles. The competition name is Girls Wanna Code Season 5. As the name suggests, it is only for the women engineer. So first talking about what is Girls Wanna Code. So it was an initiative started in 2018 to enhance women in tech to promote women empowerment in India. Last date to register for this competition is 31st March 2024. Its applications are out now. Only 15 days are left to register. So make sure you register. I'll provide the application link in the description box. So yeah, let's start this with the eligibility criteria. So who all are eligible for this? Anyone who is pursuing BTEC and they are in their third or fourth year of engineering and anyone who is pursuing MTEC and they are in first or second year of MTEC. So they are eligible to apply. Only female students are allowed to participate in this competition. And there are 47 to 50 colleges who are eligible for Flipkart GWC. So you can check while registration. If your college is in the list, then you are eligible. And if your college name is in not the list, then you are not eligible to apply in this competition. Okay. Next coming to how many rounds will be there. So basically three rounds are there. Mainly there are three rounds. Uh, first is online coding challenge. Then next is the learning cohort. And the last is the interview and OA after the cohort based on your performance. So let's discuss one by one. First is online coding challenge round. It will be of 90 minutes. You will have two sections. One is MCQ and other is DSA based. Mainly uh, approximately four coding questions will be there. So in the MCQ, what kind of questions you can expect are OOP, DBMS, simple data, simple data structures, uh, algorithm based questions, and the complexity of the question in the previous in the previous season was medium to hard. And like in the MCQ part, you can also expect infix or postfix calculation or which data structure will be used to called DFS algo or calculate time complexity or figure out what data structure can be used for a particular code or mainly the CS fundamentals, simple data structures, time complexity, like they, they'll give you a code snippet and you need to find the time complexity or they can ask is uh, this is this is particular situation. Now tell which data structure will be efficient to use. So for answering these type of questions, you need to memorize the time complexity. You need to know how time complexity is calculated for our code snippet. Okay. So, and in DSA, basically the four questions which will uh, be required to solve in only the 90 minutes time span, MCQ and DSA both. So, in the DSA, as our senior suggested, there were many questions from dynamic programming, greedy, trees. L, um, arrays, strings, recursion. So basically you need to focus on DP very much. Start revising DP concepts now. Uh, it is like DP is most commonly asked in Flipkart uh, GWC program. Okay. So yeah, this was all about the DSA question. Uh, and same as the MCQ part, the complexity of the questions was medium to hard level, lead code level questions, medium to hard. Okay. Next coming to this learning cohort. So anyone who clears this online coding challenge, basically uh, you need to clear as many test cases as you can. So who can clear the test cases and in a minimum time span, they, they will be selected. So like in our college, in the previous cohort, previous season, uh, four to five students were selected for cohort time. Okay. Then after getting selected in online coding challenge, you will receive a mentorship period like there will be four modules in the previous season it was a four months mentorship this year i'm not sure uh, basically you will have four modules uh, like you will have sessions and after each session you will be given an assignment uh, which you need to solve and uh, in the sessions you will be uh, guided how to crack and like how to gain knowledge uh, skills required to crack interview for any top-notch company or they'll introduce you to the flipkart culture and what software engineers at the flipkart do Basically, all about your knowledge, skills, they'll enhance them. 
and you can even ask the queries to the mentors and you can ask the questions and get clarified up about any of the concepts to the from the mentor okay so first was online coding challenge you get selected then there was a mentorship period वो वहाँ पे डी पी सिखाएंगे आपको डेटा स्ट्रक्चर के कुछ कॉन्सेप्ट बताएंगे असाइनमेंट्स देंगे आपको कंप्लीट करने होंगे एंड बेस्ड ऑन अप बेस्ड अपॉन दैट परफॉर्मेंस आपको ओ ए का लिंक आएगा एंड देन आफ्टर टेक इंटरव्यू सो जिसने लर्न जिसका लर्निंग कोर्ट में अच्छा परफॉर्मेंस रहा एंड लाइक ऑल दो विल बी सेलेक्टेड फॉर सिटिंग इन द ओ एके सो दिस ओ ए इज डिफरेंट फ्रॉम दैट ऑनलाइन कोडिंग चैलेंज इट इज अ थर्ड राउंड ये प्योरली आपका डीएसए बेस्ड होगा इसमें जो क्वेश्चन लास्ट ईयर आए थे देवर ट्रीज ट्रिंग रिकर्जन डीपी ग्रीडी सो इट इज लाइक डीपी वॉज आस्ट इन द ऑनलाइन कोडिंग चैलेंज ऑल्सो एंड इट वॉज ऑल्सो आस्ट इन दिस ओ एल्सो एंड इट लेवल वॉज ऑल्सो मीडियम टू हार्ड ऑल्सो फोकस ऑन दी एलगोज डीपी एंड लिंगलेस टॉपिक्स ऑल्सो सो बेसिकली यू नीट स्ट्रॉन्ग रेस्प ऑन द डीएसए ओके and after clearing the oe you will receive uh, like a interview link uh, basically two tech interviews was were there in the previous season and brush up all the concepts of yours keep practicing dsa consistently uh, don't leave it in between your mid terms or end terms uh, and also while the interviews first tell them the blue post then optimize the solution and like to make the code efficient Name the variables according to the question, not not like int e, int a. What do you mean by e or a? If you are solving any question, so name the variable name according to that question only. And uh, the questions you can practice from GFG interview bit or lead code. It is not necessary that you have already seen the questions earlier. It can be very new to new to. Uh, don't copy paste the code. There are strict guidelines for this. and try to figure out the solutions if you get the concept solve it code it quickly don't stuck it in one particular question and don't get demotivated ye nahi to koi opportunity to aap grab kar hi lo okay so this was all about the flipkart gwc program ab aate hain resources kaise padhe dsa ke liye agar cpp se kar raha hai cpp ya java kisi se bhi kar raha hai to best course is driver a to z course next agar cpp specific karna hai ट्राइवर भैया ने सी और जावा दोनों में कोड लिखा लिखवाते हैं हम तो वो तो ऑलराउंडर कोर्स है मस्त है एक ए टू जी ए टू जी सीट है आपकी वो फॉलो कर सकते हैं आप सीपीपी के लिए स्पेसिफिकली एक है कोड हेल्प बाय लव बुबर भैया उनका सुप्रीम बैच चलता है वो भी बेस्ट है जावा के लिए आप एप कोडिंग रेफर कर सकते हो अपना कॉलेज रेफर कर सकते हो पैप कोडिंग इज फ्री नाउ कमिंग टू कोर कॉन्सेप्ट कहाँ से करें तो कोर कॉन्सेप्ट के लिए मैं एक डोक प्रोवाइड करूंगी आपको आप उसमें से देख सकते हो लाइक like, आपको रोड मैप मिल जाएगा ऊप्स कैसे करना है आपको रोड मैप मिल जाएगा डीबीएमएस कहाँ से करना है या इंजीनियर्स के लिए जो भी आप फील्ड होते हैं वेब डेवलपमेंट एंड्रॉइड डेवलपमेंट कंप्यूटर नेटवर्क डीबीएमएस एस क्यू एल ऊप्स तो इन सब के लिए आपको एक रोड मैप की प्लेस दे दूंगी मैं जो लव बर ही आती है तो आपको डॉक में सारी चीजें मिल जाएंगी मैं डिस्क्रिप्शन में एड कर दूंगी मेक श्योर यू चेक इट आउट तो या दिस वॉज ऑल अबाउट एंड ऑल्सो देर आर मेनी वीडियोज about the interviews or at various companies like morgan stanley google and sap mine and linkedin adobe dny mellon american express you can check them on my channel okay so all the best goodbye